So hi everyone, I'm Alza, it's Mark, and together we are a team uh, about a duo called Kreda. Uh, it's in Chalk in Ukrainian, so we are both Ukrainian artists. Um, and work which we want to talk about today uh, is work which is called Regis Numbers. It's art performance in there, it's like live installation. Um, so this is work about uh, about war, about ignorance uh, of what's happening during the old wars and especially in the war in Ukraine which we're going on right now. Um, so yeah. So the word depicts people as numbers, as ones, and it's a reference to how we see uh, the word Ukraine depicted in the media. It's not usually about stories, but about the numbers. So it's a genocide, but it's talked about like a number, and next people don't see it, and they really just appreciate what, well, basically the number says. And it creates a sort of ignorance, and the work is also about the ignorance towards the genocide which is happening. Uh, so right now it's estimated that uh, well it's very hard to estimate but again uh, from what we know it can be somewhere from 100,000 to 250,000 civilians killed and much more of them have been uh, have some sort of damage to their health so right now today we're going to only depict 20,000 once because it's the highest we could go today and the highest we could achieve that during this performance so it will be like one tenth of only the civilians killed right now we have like five thousand over here which we pre-prepared for you and uh, uh, basically we want to thank Okna for hosting us here and for having us here and helping us set up this performance uh, we also uh, what else uh, so we will be uh, silent during the performance and we would not talk but uh, you can, if you want to talk with us after the performance, you can do it somewhere at about 9.30, 9.45, something like that, and then we'll finish. And uh, that's the time we can talk. You can, if you're tired, it's okay to like walk away or return later, or not return at all, it's, it's completely fine. Uh, also, you have the inspiration and the background of the project in here, as well as all the annotations, so you can read them in the booklet. I guess that's it, and we're going to start.